Welcome to instructional videos. Today we are going to install the Eurofit bracket onto the spinner base. Before you begin, you want to make sure that you have an extension cord or power strip handy, which is not included. So first thing we're going to do is install the bracket onto the spinner base. So to install the bracket, we're going to take the bottom of the bracket and screw it onto the metal knob that is located in the middle of the spinner base. And then you're just going to tighten it into place. Now that you have the bracket tightened into place, you're ready to install either the two foot or three foot brackets onto this base. So the Eurofit brackets can either be used with a two foot or three foot Eurofit wall. So the farther holes are for a three foot wall and the closer holes are for a two foot wall. So I have a three foot wall, so I'm going to install the holes that are farthest away from the push button onto the edge of my bracket. So you're just going to align the holes and then using the included screws, you're just going to tighten into place. Using the hex wrench, we're just going to tighten. I'm going to repeat the exact same steps for the other side. So I'm going to make sure to install the holes farthest from my push button onto the bracket. Now that I have my base connected together, we're ready to install our Eurofit. To install the Eurofit, you're simply going to remo remove both feet from my Eurofit. So using the push button, we're just going to remove both feet. Now that I have both feet removed, I'm just going to align I'm just going to align my Eurofit onto the pegs located on the bracket. And then using the push button, I'm just going to secure. Now that I have my wall installed, I'm ready to attach the power cord. So I'm just going to plug the power cord into my base. Then I'm going to plug my power cord into an outlet. And it's just that easy to install the Eurofit bracket onto the spinner base. 